There's a bunch of parachutes there. and got one. Oh my, they're a lot quieter today. One part was right there and I got another one right there. Another is just one right there. I'm gonna go back to the skidoo and pick these off first. Well, look at that. Just got the two there to one shot. And uh, I get the camera, I'll tell you, it's uh, really nippy in the fingers today. It's cold. Yes, sir. Got to pick them off fast today because it's really cold to the fingers. Yeah, but I mean to say, they are really, really quite today to what they, they mean like here. I'm trying to get tree to one shot here. Hide behind this little tree here. I think he pitched over there. Oh, I almost squeezed the trigger. Well, I often get asked, uh, you know, what kind of ammo do I use? And most times when I'm parrot and shotting, I'm using up uh, old ammo. Uh, some of these are number four shot and some of these are number six shot. And I even got a couple of three and a half inch number two shots in my pocket. Uh, yeah, when the birds are handy, I'll pick it a low brass shell. If they're a little further away, I pick it a better shell. And uh, yeah, works good for me. Come down along here, and there was one well over there, so I uh, I had a three and a half inch shell, and I got in, but I got to go back around uh, to get in there, and uh, yeah, just using up small ammo today. Uh, now, three and a half inch shells, I don't use in parry hunting very often, probably the first time ever, but uh, they worked. I, uh, I normally use, you know, number four shot. When I can't get that, I get number six shot, and now I'm even using number two shot. No. Picky after now and have a look at it. Oh, one shot in three deer. Look, beautiful, beautiful uh, pet reach for the pot. I seize one pet reach deer. It looks a bit quite, so I'll just go with a, a low breath. Yeah. That was the only one that was there too, bud. Now, I always put your hempies in a different pocket. <laughs> Sometimes you reach in and holler the hempy. Oh no. <laughs> you know, I could, uh, I could see a big difference in the purposes today. Much more quieter. I almost thought I heard one down right there. Have to look after. So this is a uh, six already. Yeah, you know, it's just great being here on the land. You know, if I don't get either other one today, I'd still be happy. You know. Yeah. Got a few now to keep the pot going. That was the main thing. I was completely out of them before I got a few there the day before yesterday. Well, look at this. Got number seven, that's the only one that was here. And the day is only young yet. There was two purposes there, one still there, another one just fly and just pitch down right there. You know, even when, you, even when you do fly, you don't fly very far. A lot quieter today. And uh, uh, I'm not in no rush to shoot that part reach. <laughs> Look at how quiet he is in the altars there. Nope. Yeah. Nope. That's where. 
that. I might have to use a high brass one. And you know, there could be more than that there. Uh, I'm not sure if you'll see that or not. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to fire this one, then I'm going to watch that one. Slide, but uh, just we can't know this there again. Yeah, it's warming up fast too now. I tell you, it was really, really nippy on fingers this morning, but uh, it's getting real nice now. Look at all the sawing in around here. So. Another fine one for the pot. There was three right here. I fired and killed one. There's one right there. Another one there. A bit far. See what happens, man. Right? And oh, another one just pitched right there. Oh, gonna go back get snowshoes. He's just right there. Eyes don't fly. That one's there, so that's two. Dim two there makes up ten. I guess that one would be eleven. But anyway, when you get into double digits, I call that a good hunt then. That one fly there again, and the wind is picking up there a little bit, but uh, can't complain. That makes ten. Floyd and I said, my gosh, what happened? By watching, watching it, and one fell down over here. Looks like a, a weasel going off with something. Must have made a kill. He came along and he uh, he dragged it on down there. I was hoping to see some feathers or whatever just to see what it was. I like to have that one all junked up for the shed. Come down along here. I got to get a drink of water and I just flushed up a part reach. It just went up on that bank there. <laughs> Oh, I tell you, that is good. I just shot one, didn't know where she went. Down down here, look. Makes number 12. And uh, when I killed that one, a bunch floated up and I only pitched over right there. Now, I don't think they went very really far. Oh, empty. Oh dear. That's three more. There's more than that here. Those three uh, makes uh, 15. There's four. I say four, maybe five more come over here. So, get her up that way. I'm gonna walk down this way first and circle on down around there. And I'm gonna, I'll pick up those uh, power just once. Well, I got five right here, and there's one right there, and there's another one there somewhere. So, 722. Uh, <laughs> uh, she'll jammed in a gun. I had to take her apart real quick. Well, I get my snowshoes on. Uh, yeah, Tom's getting tired as well. Now, oh yeah, there he is. 
that makes 22 three more for the limit we have a limit of 25 parmigan so who knows we might get there if we don't it doesn't matter well i must say my tom is fatigued well i must say fantastic hunt uh i'm gonna settle on 22 i think uh you know it's been a long long day and i got a nice little wall here before i get back home uh really happy so i got enough power just now for a while so uh i guess it'll be ice fishing next <laughs>